YouTube, Wagwan. Uh, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Beat Making Friday. Um, this is going to be a simple, fast beat. I mean, we're going to make the beat fast because we're just going to drag, drag in some loop and we're going to just drag in the last drum pattern or the last time. So, first thing I'm going to do is go up to File, go to Import, Logic Projects. So, remember now, this is what how me make my beats them are. You know what I mean? You can follow this or you, you, you can make it from scratch. But this is like lazy beat making. So this is how I do today. All right? Um, so we are, yeah, we're going to load up this. And we're going to take the 808. We're going to take the hi-hat. We're going to take the kick. And the snare. And the crash. And the reverse crash. Yeah, we're going to load that up. We're not gonna use no Vox sound tonight. Um or we might. We don't know. But we're gonna use um we're gonna load something from um the genius um sound pack. Make sure you go grab that at over at splice, splice.com. Alright. I'm gonna just wanna say thank you to all the subscribers, you know. I think we have uh 740. 740 something, something like that. But yeah, I'm thankful for every subscriber we may have. Trust me. So when we reach a thousand, um, may I go like or something, something like um, may not know yet. But once we reach a thousand subscriber, may I go like or something to somebody. All right. So let's go. I think I we'll find something we're we'll gonna use. So we're we'll gonna use um. Where it is? Uh, this. Hopefully you guys can hear it. Right, not too loud. Yeah, so we're going to use that. So we're going to drag that into a different track. Right? Hold on. Drag it and drop it. How come it now work? I drag and drop it. Boom. All right. We're going to drag this up all the way up top. I'm going on them here. Go down, can we now use this? Drag this all the way down. All right, so now we have everything up here. Um, I'm going to use, there's another thing we want to use. We want to use the strings. They have some strings, you know, right? And we're going to use that too. So we'll drag that in, down here, boom. Drag that up. Yeah. Yeah, and I hate that. Hopefully... Hopefully, you'll see how we do that. Right? From there, so. I can see if we can hear it. Alright, kind of loud. I can turn it down. Sorry about that. Alright? Alright, something wrong. Something off. So, I think... We're going to lower this to, to 110 BPM. Yeah. That's how it's supposed to sound right there. Um, and then we'll just copy everything over. You know it go already. If you've been watching the channel, you know it go already. Um, and we want to... So we want to load... These two. We want a next track. So we'll duplicate that. Right? And then we want this to come down here for the verse. Hold on. Right here. We want we want thing that actually no, we don't want we don't want to add our next track. Um may I think what for the yeah, we'll add two more. We're going to add two more track. Duplicate that. And then we're going to drag this down to here. And then, yeah, we're going to make it sound different. So, let's work on this. Because want... All we're going to do to that is this. We're going to just um, 
make sure we do both of them at the same time. And we'll go to this this button right over here, over to your left where it says read. You click that and then go to touch. And then for the both of them, we're going to add um, an EQ. Hold on. We're going to add an EQ. Where the channel EQ? Channel EQ. Right? And we're going to do the same thing we with, with normally do. Uh, and bring this all the way to 500. And this is how it sounds right now. Maybe check out some more, hold on. All right, so now that now work. We could do something different. So I go take those out and then do this instead. Copy that. And we can see how this work. And it won't bounce in place. So I can hear, I can see if that can work. So I think it's option and B. No. Control and B to bounce that in place. And then press OK. Alright, so it's supposed to bounce from here it's sound. Alright, good. So now we can work on that by itself. Right? Then we we'll add the EQ. So now we we'll add the EQ. I'm going to hear that sound. Bring it all the way to five, 500 here. I'm going to hear that sound. Yeah. Yeah, so that's how it got sound. Right here for the, um, for the verse. So we'll bring this over here to the verse. And then we'll work on it. So same thing now. You go over here where it says read. Over to your left. Click that. And press touch. And then go to the EQ. And then we're going to gradually bring it up. Like this. So you go right here and you gradually bring it up. Like this. Bring it up slowly. So that's how it, that's how it's gonna sound when it reach to the verse, to the verse part. So everything I got sound like this now. So what we wanna do is EQ more EQ this and take out the bass. So EQ that. Take out the bass out of it. Carry to like 200k right here. Same thing with the str with the strings. Get an EQ. Take out the bottom end. Hopefully not follow along. I'm gonna want a video to take too long, so we'll go read up. Alright, so we have the intro, the chorus, and the verse. Alright? So for the intro. We really don't need the string still. So we can take that out. And we'll just bring in um, the string in the chorus part. Take this out a little bit. There we go. And I hit that. That's the old beat right there. So um, for the A to it now, we know it says A minor. So we'll go in here and just put it to A minor. Actually, let's bring this up to here, right? And then just bring everything down to A minor. Let me see where it is. Actually, it's at A minor already, so boom. And then we'll take this out, take this out, take this out, and then we'll just copy this over. Copy that over. Boom. Take out the first part out of there. And then take out the last part. So yeah, simple. And that's it. That's the beat for today, for Beat Making Friday. 
Give me the comments down below and you know, let me know what else you want know, to see. All right? But this was just an easy beat making. You drag a couple loops in and then it's a beat. All right? So let's go. Let's listen to it and hear it sound. <laughs> in the snare. Ready? Let's go chorus. that um if you want to add something else to it um I don't know you add, you add a next track I'm gonna just do this real quick because I a minor create right and then no mm, I could say no we don't want to add your track sorry about that track new and create a software track right and we're gonna put in a, a vac sound just because we want to do it um you don't have to, but I normally do it, so I'm going to just put it in anyway. I'm just going to grab a quick vo uh, vac sound. Um, need to grab something real quick. No tart in it at all. Um, put this at A minor. I always put, um, when they use, uh, when they're using um, hooks, or, I mean arcade, you have to put it in the key of the song, um, or is it not going to work? So A minor, actually it's A flat minor, right? And then we're going to just use, we're going to just use this. I, 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 I can't remember, I can't, I'm to blame. I feel the way I feel, feel the way I feel. On, but anyway, I could just use that. So record. Two, three, four. Let's do that. Let's just use that. Did that record? I could try to record that again. I I think that record. Let's go record. Two, three, four. Hopefully that not still no record. I don't know what's going why it not record. Alright, make a try again. Supposed to record. You know what? We're gonna do it a different way. Make I just grab this. Cause we don't really want to waste the time. And then we just search for it. Actually. Like I said, P. All right, so. I don't know if that was the one that we'll pick, but anyway, let me see. Yeah, 
Yeah, let's use this one. Alright. We're just gonna use this and call it a day. Yep. Alright, that's it. And then we just drag this throughout the whole beat. I can see if that work. Sorry this has take so long. But you don't know. This is just how it goes. Alright. So right now we're gonna use an EQ and EQ it. Um take out the bass so tight. Cut to like 5k right there. And take this to about let me hear this sound. <laughs> Alright, so we'll leave it like that for right now. Uh don't know you have to label your track, so Vox sound. Vox, um, we're gonna do now add like a reverb onto it and then just leave it. And that's it. Now I'm gonna do nothing else. Um so reverb, we'll go to space designer and add that. <laughs> other things you can play around with in arcade so you can bring up back arcade and then you can put in um an echo let's hear that Actually, now nah, feel a vox on there, but ah oh, man. All right, I could just I could try to find something real quick. Yeah, yeah. So we're just going to leave it with that. Um, yeah, we're going to leave it like that, you know. Um, but you get the idea. Um, you can put Vox on. You can drag in loops and make a beat. All right? Um, if you keep working on it, you can find some different uh, Vox sound. We will go good with this beat. But we're going to just leave it as is right now. Um, make sure you like and subscribe to the channel if you like what you say, if you like what I want. Um, put in the comments below what you want to say. All right, I'm going to play the beat, and then, yeah, I hit that beat making Friday. Let's go. Yeah, so I hit that. That's the beat. Uh, beat making Friday. Like and subscribe. Um, I'm actually like it without the Vox sound, so I'm going to leave it out. All right? But like and subscribe. 
and I'll see you in the next video. All right? I'm out.